<laughs> Kicks 105.5, a very good morning to you. Uh, it is time for Good Policies with Mike Barrett from Barrett Insurance, as we do each and every Wednesday. And uh, you know what I like most about you uh, versus the other people that I have interviewing here? Ooh, is hopefully that they're not listening right now. It, <laughs> nah, they're still sleeping. Okay, good. I just say hi, and you pretty much take the rest of the program and run with it. And I really dig that because it gives me that, you know, three or four minutes to, to enjoy that subtle nap that I enjoy so much during this time. So uh, I hope you enjoyed that because I have nothing for you today, so you're going to have to really, like, work for it. It was I... nice stepping in here for a minute, and uh, have a good day, Mike. Thanks for stopping. <laughs> uh, so last week you had to call in because we had uh, issues. More? <laughs> you know... I wish I could insure the uh, the uh, city of St. Johnsbury uh, for for water mains. The city, I, the town, the, the I, I'd make a million dollars. Be like, hey, let me put some insurance on this water main breaking. It's almost like legal betting. It um, really would be, yeah. yeah. You you had, uh, of course, the same issues as all the rest of the residents and businesses had, where. Um, no water, and mm-hmm. then then it was a water boil notice, and uh, I went to go drink. I was at the hospital, and I went to go drink out of the fountain, and I stopped and went, mm, maybe I should. Yeah, not today. Not today. So uh, Good Policies is the name of the program, mm-hmm. and uh, with that, of course, Good Policies follow, and uh, you've got so many things that you do there, um, and you say that this is a family thing that's been going on for, you know, what, your father and you, did your grandfather do it also? No. No, no. No. Okay. By the way, you do realize I'm making you actually do all the talking today, yeah. <laughs> based on what you said I'm, moments ago. I'm still going, going, and <laughs> making you talk. All right, fine. You fed me enough. I'll, 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 I'll feed into it for a second here. <clears throat> so, <laughs> it is a good idea, you know, because we've. I think I talked about it two weeks ago when we, we did our first interview together here. But um, I'll give you the full rundown because we kind of deviated onto renters insurance and things back then. So back in 1989, my father, Richard Barrett. Uh, Purchased the agency from Nathan Morrill, who was a longtime uh, co-op insurance agent. I believe it was going back to 1969. Is that of Morrill and Geyer? No. No, no relation. Moral. Okay. Different Morrill. Well, and there might be some relation, but I'm not And totally the moral sure. of this story. <laughs> but I'm bummed. So in 1989, Dad uh, uh, purchased the agency. Shortly thereafter, my mother uh, came on board and became a licensed agent. And for over 20 years, they uh, ran the agency together. Um, And then uh, when she passed, my wife and I came up to help Dad out. And then we uh, stuck through it and just purchased him out this year. So now we're we're a second-generation husband and wife, as crazy as that is. Yeah, to, I worked uh, with my wife a couple of times, and it didn't work out so well. <laughs> I made the mistake once of telling my wife, I said, remember, my last name really, you know, I am the Barrett through blood. So I'm the boss at work, Ooh. and she goes, that's fine. <laughs> I'm the boss at home. Like, no, 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 scratch that, scratch that. I totally meant to not say that oh, out loud. Man. So um, uh, when I was growing up, my family actually had an electronic company and a restaurant, mm-hmm. and I remember uh, grabbing people's things Things like computers and, uh, you know, calculators and taking it back to the repair shop. And when we did restaurant work, I remember, you know, grabbing dirty plates. Um, when you were growing up, were, was your dad like, hey, can you fill out this insurance form for me? Or, <laughs> Thank uh, God, no. Did you spend a lot of time at the office at that time? <laughs> I, I was the janitor. Oh, you yeah, okay. Initially, yeah. Yeah, yeah family business. Teenager you know. janitor, so the place was never really clean. <laughs> I just turned the vacuum on, walked around, swore that I had to do it, waiting for my dad to give me a few bucks, and then I took off. Just standing in one place. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I hate this thing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, so I mean, you know, but dinner conversation always, you know, they always brought work home, which I know a lot of people say is a bad thing, but to be able to have a dialogue and just talk about the exposures and the things that you're working on, it's really good information. So I picked up a little bit over the years, got to the point where all my friends would ask me insurance questions. I'm like, you do realize it's my dad that's the insurance agent, not me, (laughs) you know, but here we are. I was spending some time with uh, Alan from Easy Autos the other day, and uh, he was talking about all the things that you do, you like to record our sessions, and you have a, a, like a YouTube or a website or a you know you're 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 like an audio visual kind of guy. You have all these things available for people on social media. You follow a lot of things on your phone, um, and he was like, "Yeah, I just sell cars. <laughs> <laughs> I come in, but but I guess that you are sparking interest to do these types of things. Um, how is social media changing?" the future or how do you see it from when your dad had it right. to to what you do now do you think people come in because they're like oh i saw this on xyz mm-hmm. and uh, absolutely 
You know, uh, my wife, uh, she used to be in sales, um, not insurance sales, different sales, radio sales of all things. And um, uh, her, No future. Yeah, no future. She got the heck out of there. Um, but her, her best line, and we actually used this as our motto initially, was uh, hers was saying not advertising is like winking at a girl in the dark. You know you're doing what you're doing, but nobody else does. <laughs> so we kind of used that as our mantra of sorts to get online, realizing that that was where a lot of things were going to be. So we do see a lot of traffic as a result of our of our online presence. I love that, by the way. I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna talk about that for years to come. <laughs> That's winking in the dark. Yes, you That's, know you're doing it, but nobody else does. So. Well, the cat might because he has night vision. Right, and the dog too. <laughs> but, but uh, you know, so that's really it. And it led us to creating a Facebook page, and we have uh, just shy of 400 likes, which compared to your Facebook page is, is it, most would say, well, that's pretty sad. No, but, no, no, don't say, don't say mine. Kicks 105.5. Oh, sorry. The- mine, my mother and my grandmother follow me, <laughs> and that's it. I don't even have my children as followers on well, mine. Well, they blocked you very wise, very wisely. <laughs> but, you know, to, for us to have... Have close to 400 likes as, as a small family insurance agency. Take out the small family and just say insurance. We're insurance. People do not necessarily like insurance, so we're so honored for people to even consider to like our page. It's a necessary evil, and I think that uh, you make it a fun experience. And uh, when you have that knowledge, and you're one of the people from this community, it makes it more of a connection with people. Anything you want to talk about before you take off? No. The fact I that you didn't I've bring tor- breakfast. I've tortured you enough by Again. making you talk more today. So. Um, <laughs> Um, but I can give you all the details. Please do. Lay down. Barrett Insurance Agency. We're on Portland Street in St. Johnsbury. We uh, uh, are still accepting applications uh, for a job opening we have for a CSR producer. You can email us, apply at the barrettagency.com, or you can find us on a few of the job posting sites like Workable and things of that nature. Uh, you can check out our Facebook page, which also has the job posting on there, uh, Barrett Insurance Agency, and our website, which also has the job posting, thebarrettagency.com. Thank you so much. Have Mike. a great week, and I'll try to bring something to the table next week. Yeah. No well, promises. Donuts would be fine on the side here. <laughs>